30% physical. So to construct, forget the change. You don't need the change yet. To construct Tai Chi stance, widen your stance, the same stance as you had in upward, downward, inward, outward in the beginning. So toes in, pelvis under, spine erect, knees out, heels down. This is the beginning. Now you're going to build Tai Chi stance, hold your arms, reach forward, and round it. Looks like a hula hoop. Hold it and lower your stance. Don't hold it up high. Drop your shoulders. Here's the form. Very, very, very simple. Not hard. In fact, you can do this all day long and not get tired. Inhale, open. Still keep your mind three inches below your navel. Exhale. Inhale. Exhale. Now, beginners do this. Inhale. This is wrong. Very wrong. Very wrong. Smaller is better, but don't force it to be small. Inhale, open. Exhale. Inhale, open. Exhale. The more advanced you get, the smaller it gets. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale. Exhale. Now remember, you can do this forever. It doesn't get any harder the longer you do it. Exhale. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale. Exhale. Side view. When you go up, you're not straightening your knees. They're staying a little bent. Inhale. Notice my spine. Straight as an arrow. Head pulled back. Chin dropped. Inhale. Knees out, toes in, heels down. Exhale. Pelvis under. Exhale. Inhale. Exhale. Backward view. Inhale, open. Exhale. My back and spine are somewhat bowed. That means my chest is sunk. My spine is bowed, but very little. You can't really see it. I don't want this. Tai Chi stance. Inhale, open. Exhale. Inhale. Exhale. Pull up to preparation. Now remember, when you're practicing temple style, which form you're doing doesn't matter but you're going to spend enough time on each one so that when you add the next form, your body is ready. Your joints are open, your muscles are strong enough, your breathing is right, your movements are coordinated. You don't want to just rush through. This tape is going to take you five, six, seven, eight, nine months maybe to go through from beginning to end. Now, what you can do is continue to practice on your own. We will now take a break. I will now teach you the transition between raised hand stance and Tai Chi stance. We will start by support leg left. Go into a raised hand stance. Inhale. Turn forward to, what you're going to do is you're going to take your left hand, your low hand, depending on how you're facing, and you're going to turn the left hand down by the waist and the right hand will stay right where it is from here, the high hand. Shift 100% of your weight to the support leg. Step out, let your left arm or your, your moving arm go around and reshape the second half of Tai Chi stance. Sink. Inhale. Exhale. Now we're going to change again to the opposite. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale. Change. Exhale. The low hand now is going to go down by the waist. Shift 100%. Extend your stance. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale. Change again. Inhale. 
Exhale. Inhale. Change. Now we'll learn the transition. Don't worry if you're doing the form right. Inhale. Exhale, change. Inhale. Change. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale. Exhale. You might think the breathing's unclear. The opening movements are inhales, the closing movements are exhales. Inhale. Exhale. I'll now do it without talking, except for the count. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale. Exhale. Take a two second break. I don't want to confuse you. You need to take breaks between transition practice. Start over again. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale. Exhale. If you're not sure, back up the video to where I've explained it already. Exhale. Inhale. 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 Exhale. Exhale. Inhale. Exhale. Now we're going to do the same thing. Inhale, except less transition. Exhale. We're just going to do the form. Raised hand stance, support leg. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale. Exhale. A little more. 100% single weighted. Don't forget to tap your toe, tap your heel, tap your toe, tap your heel. Change the Tai Chi stance. If you don't know the transition, go back and practice. Inhale. Exhale, change. Exhale. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale. Drop your shoulders. 100% back leg. Tap your toe, heel, toe, heel, toe, heel. Change Tai Chi stance. Now, there's no reason to spend a lot of time doing this form. Now, you'll notice most of you probably have already used my Qigong video or have taken the workshop. These are the same moves, except for raised hand stance. Exhale, inhale, exhale. Here the physical details are important. In Qigong, the physical details are not important. The Qi circulations are important. Here there's no Qi circulations. Inhale, only do what I tell you. Don't get creative and think you know. Don't mix details from Qigong into your Tai Chi. You'll have a problem. A problem doesn't mean you'll have energy problems. It means you'll be lousy. You won't know what you're doing. Exhale. Quality matters. Exhale. I'm going to pull back up to preparation now. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale. Exhale. And what we're going to do next, and I will give you a break, and the time between learning Tai Chi stance, raised hand stance, transition, and practicing the forms, compete.